Hello everyone, Dan here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, I'll be doing a review for DC Night Terrors number two. Uh, this is a new book from DC Comics. Let's take a look at the creative team here. Uh, this is written by Joshua Williamson with art by Giuseppe Camoncoli. Uh, little colors by Stefano Nessi and Casper Wingard. Um, Frank Martin on colors. Oh, shit. Hello everyone, Daniel here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, I'll be doing a review for Night Terrors number two. This is a new book from DC Comics. Let's take a look at the creative team here. We have uh, Joshua Williamson on writing duties. We have multiple artists, art by Giuseppe Camoncoli, Stefano Nessi, and Casper Wingard. Colors by Frank Martin. Uh, looks like Wingard is coloring his own stuff. And letters by Troy Piteri. Uh, in this issue, uh, we have some narration from Dead Men. Oh dang! I got a new. I got to do another one of these this month. Batman and I are in are joined by Wesley Dodds. So yes, as you can see in the cover, Wesley Dodds, the original Sandman, is back. In uh, is back in the world of DC. Um, and then Dead Man continues on to say, "I thought I was the only dead person allowed in this story. I guess not. We uncover one of Wesley's oldest cases, which haunted him until the day he died." And it points us to the direction of the Nightmare Stone. But Insomnia has unleashed his own army to hunt us down. The Sleepless Nights. And in this issue, their first appearance, kids get scared. Um, I really think it, it's funny trying to give these synopses that are given in the third person. Uh, or I guess in the voice of the character. Uh, but yeah, uh, Deadman has been our narrator that's taken us through the, the story, which is really fun. Uh, as you can see here from the art. We always begin with like these with the dead air little uh, vignettes, right? These are kind of the device for to tell the story. Uh, and having Wesley Dots the Sandman back in the DC universe, it's amazing. Like it's it's a really fun character to explore. I think his powers are really cool. Obviously, there's a lot there's a lot of love for Sandman in any iteration. Uh, but yeah, this is great. I think all the artists work perfectly together because they are. We have different artists for a purpose, right? Uh, whether it's the narration from uh, Dead Man, whether it's a flashback like this, uh, or whether it's just our main story. Um, this book is really well put together. So shout out to the editor team on this. Um, actually, uh, Ben Abernathy looks to be the editor on this event. Uh, so yeah, shout out to Ben. Uh, putting a team together like this really fun, really great story. The story gives you a lot, uh, and then the stakes are really uh, they're raised in this issue because of the appearance of the sleepless nights. So, how are they going to get out of this one? Also, the the havoc kind of continues all throughout the DC line with all the other books. So, let me know what you thought about this issue if you read it. Uh, there's some variant covers at the at the back of the issue at the back of the at the end of the video. Uh, so make sure to stay tuned for that. Uh, and as always, thank you for watching, everyone. Remember to share, like, subscribe, hit the bell so you know when we go live. That is most Saturdays, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. We have more comic reviews, movie reviews, TV reviews, and recaps, all that fun stuff here in the channel. And as always, thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.